good evening guys uh, it's a great occasion today uh, because i have with me a uh, rank one in surgical gastroenterology need super specialty um surgical gastroenterology obviously is the most competitive branch and uh, abid has cracked it and has done it quite uh, splendidly by getting the rank one so how does it feel abid today uh first of all good evening sir uh, is uh, obviously it feels great <laughs> and uh, getting surgical gi i never thought i would get rank 1 obviously i was trying to get into the rank list but uh, somehow and uh, you know so for preparing last two years it was quite difficult with covid and all those things and getting your preparation uh, then uh, you know so, you know finishing in time and getting everything brushed up obviously when you get in there it's really you know one of the best feelings you can ever have and uh, i think it is awesome Awesome, Good. and it's not. It's not just definitely the uh, like whatever you say. Rank one is rank one, so that feeling is totally unmatched. Uh, Abin, uh, yeah. tell us more about yourself. Uh, like, where did you do your UG? Where did you do your PG? So I uh, did my uh, UG from GMC Srinagar, is in Kashmir a Medical College. Uh, I completed it in two thousand fourteen. then uh, i completed my ms uh, from sher kashmir institute of medical sciences it is uh, there again in srinagar uh, in 2018 then uh, so i tried uh, for, in the first very first year after my ms i i was thinking i would go for urology uh, but somehow during my first year uh, when i was SR, doing my srs so i thought i thought i'm more uh, you know uh, comfortable with the uh, abdomen and all that so i had to change my mind i could not do it in my first year uh, i could not take the uh, urology i was do studying somewhat for urology then ultimately i had to prepare for a couple of years and ultimately it bore the fruit for me and thanks to all uh, my teachers mentors um, i think they had a role to play in it it's not an uh, individual success it is always uh, there are uh, people at the background who always play a role and you know so you you just put in the efforts but more, there are much more people who actually you know make you uh, sufficient to do it i think it's, i it's, should think it, uh, i think abhi just put it very uh, rightly it's uh, uh, people assume that it's an individual effort people assume that uh, ek bande ka success hai uska hard work hai and, and i i yeah. i personally feel that's that's never the case because uh, because there's a, there's a huge uh, a missionary working behind a single person success is her success and um, i'm glad to see doctors who are uh, humble and who are ready to acknowledge such stuff because uh, i i i was just telling to just telling someone else also that uh, today's generation is much more humble and uh, uh, much more considerate of the fellow human beings than the previous generation no offense to professors but uh, that's my uh, that's my personal feeling uh, and i think abid embodies that uh, because one of the first things he said is that uh, he's he's acknowledged the fact that uh, there's a, there's a huge machine behind working behind him and yeah. that i think that's fabulous so i was just uh, saying that there is no second thought about it uh, especially your uh, parents your family then obviously the teachers and mentors who who make you this exam is uh, some so you have to prepare yourself mentally as well as uh, you know uh, the studies had to be there but mental preparation is also there and then uh, your teachers they have a role to play Uh, they guide you to the you know very end otherwise it is very uh, difficult if one somebody is preparing on his own without uh, getting guidance from people and uh, i i think the mistakes i made uh, during my first year when i appeared in the exam i i, I had contact to nobody i i, I was not subscribed to any uh, testers other series getting uh, m- myself uh, into these things i thought i would study and i would do it do i studied for one year but i i was i, I got very bad in the exams so i think uh, so teachers and uh, mentors and uh, you know they have they, they make you they prepare you you just deliver when they are behind you so that's that's really i should acknowledge that and thank you thank you sir for the, i would i would like to thank sir's test also because uh, i know sir uh, the mcq bank was very uh, helpful i i uh, got uh, both uh, mcq bank of gi surgery and uh, general surgery i think the test was very composed and uh, reliable uh, the explanations were good so i i think i should thank you also you have a role to play you are shaping the careers of so many people and it is uh, really 
good to be uh, with you there today sir i really i'm i'm honored sir thank you oh uh, i'm 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 honored uh, abid because because when students thank us it makes uh, it makes it all the more worthwhile you know whenever we think that okay uh, uh, should i continue with such as no or not it's it's just the feedback of you guys which uh, helps uh, uh, um, helps us uh, move ahead and motivate ourselves to keep going uh, so abid um like uh, how did you use the question banks the, the general surgery and the gi surgery how did you like uh, what was your study strategy when using it uh, like uh, you read the books first and then the mcqs or the mcqs first and then the yes yeah. yeah yeah so the best thing about uh, the mcq banks was they were uh, classified uh, you had every uh, you know so every chapter then uh, in sub topics there which had uh, mcqs like that so whenever i would study a topic or uh, a chapter then i would go back and uh, do the mcqs i would find the mistakes i am committing i would uh, get myself the fact that i have not got this concept correctly i have made again mistake in this so then i would go back to my text uh, so that way uh, you are able to correct yourself the mcq is a it's a it's a check for you uh, once you read something first text has to be gone through then you uh, attempt to the mcq you make a mistake then you go back to the text and then you understand what actually how because you are your teachers have already got that concept they have prepared their mcq with an intention uh, they want you to get something out of the, that topic so that is the concept behind better is to read the text first go to the mcq when you make a mistake go back to the text again or uh, ask your uh, whoever is your guide or mentor so they can help you i think uh, that is the way to about it true 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 i think i think uh, uh, abhi has put it very uh, nicely uh, regarding the mcqs uh, do you feel that the searches mcqs were pretty comprehensive they covered all the topics yes sir almost i think uh, every topic is covered uh, especially in general surgery i was uh, you know sir uh, i was very weak in general surgery last year i could not do well in general surgery paper last year but uh, i think the, the mcqs are every topic is covered every sub topic every line is covered i think it's a very comprehensive set of an mcq bank that i think everybody should uh, as far as it's not my i, I would not uh, directly recommend but uh, if people will ask me i have used it i have got much benefited thank you i mean uh thank you for your feedback abit because uh, uh uh our team has been working by the question banks i have personally created uh, some of them and it's a huge motivation when uh, a student uses it uh, to get uh, a rank great rank and uh, uh i was you know uh i was also thank the entire search team for uh, creating such a uh, mcq bank um, yes, so okay. abit is a commendable uh, job sir commendable job so abit uh, any specific uh leave aside the mcq banks tutorials and all that sort of stuff any specific mentor uh, or surgeon who who inspired you who whom you look looked up to or whom you think uh, was a major uh, a fulcrum in your career so actually uh, yeah there are obviously uh, during your ms and then uh, in the senior residency when you get uh, with good surgeons and you feel that uh you should be like him or you should be working towards this thing uh i had i had done my uh, i had done my ms from uh, sheri kashmir institute of medical sciences there are a good lot of people who do wonderful surgeries who are good at academics so uh, especially uh, i had uh, some professors there i would uh, if you if by your uh, permission i can name their them here absolutely uh, name them i had my hod sir uh, my guide uh, professor khurshid alam then uh, professor fazul ki upare uh, mubashir sir and uh, munir sir they all had a good uh, role in shaping our careers we would we would watch them we would love them watching and then uh, you develop feeling for that uh, you want to be in this field you want uh, they were doing mostly gi surgery so uh, we would feel fascinated and you know learn, seeing their surgical uh, techniques we would get that we want this thing to be done we want to be in this field so obviously uh, then uh, then uh, as far as academics is concerned if you are uh, preparing then you need some uh, you need some mentors like uh, we have at this time uh, uh, there are many platforms I, i would say many platforms are already there but uh, some uh, you know everybody has his own liking so there are some uh, people who follow mentors and i think that is great you have to you have to because sometimes you get doubts uh, from the text you need to ask somebody 
unless and until you have uh, somebody at the back who can clear them who can you know make you understand i think that is important but sometimes you understand some th- some concept differently you mark uh, you, then you uh, make mistakes out of that so i think mentors have a role to play and you should keep someone uh, at your back who should always be ready to help you out uh, i have been uh, okay. you know sir absolutely i agree mm-hmm. because because because, mm-hmm. because i i wanted you to name your uh, surgeon teachers uh, because the people who taught you during your ms uh, these are the people who are going to feel the proudest or uh, the most proud when they see your great rank and because uh, as a teacher as 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 one of the people who also teaches on on, on such as uh, i feel really proud and happy it also it all it almost feels like my own son or is doing is great i'm i'm not don't mistake me i'm not too old yeah yeah, <laughs> not, yeah yeah sure sir but I, I, it, it really feel the way that uh, uh uh because when your your teacher sees this video and he sees you thanking he is going to feel absolutely proud and uh, uh i think i think i think uh, that is wonderful because i feel that uh, uh post ms is okay ms is the time in which your surgical yeah. caring is formed and for those who are uninitiated sheri kashmir is one of the finest places in this entire country to do your surgical surgery training and uh, i'm so true. glad that uh, i have uh, dr abit from sheri kashmir uh, because i have great respect for the institute it has one of the best colorectal surgery departments also in the country yeah uh, yes yeah, sir yes sir so so uh, mm-hmm. i think i think i think it's wonderful that a uh, student from sheri kashmir has gotten uh, a top rank uh, and uh, uh, full kudos to the entire surgery department of uh, sheri kashmir too for abit's achievement uh, so abit i'm going to take yeah. it a little light uh okay okay how did you celebrate uh yeah so i was uh, actually to in the detail if you feel it's going to be embarrassing <laughs> no sir no sir is uh, is fine actually sir uh, when we got the result it was around 10 uh, pm so uh, i was actually uh, on the, i'm still working uh, in delhi one of the institutes here uh, this uh, sharda medical college greater noida so we got the result around 10 pm then we had to scratch uh, the ranks it was just the numbers at that time we had to find where we stand and then uh, after one or two hours we got to know that uh, it's rank 1 i'm rank 1 so my joy had no bounds as absolutely uh, the celebration was like i didn't get sleep for the whole night <laughs> <laughs> oh, so so uh, abid has decided not to go into the details of the celebration but yes i am sure uh, a rank one definitely deserves it so uh, abid uh, where do you see yourself uh, 10 years down the line what do you want to be doing so uh, mainly uh, i want to concentrate on uh, hepatobiliary uh, obviously it is uh, uh, one major part of gi surgery so so i want to concentrate on hepatobiliary and if uh, i have small uh, no sir i, I want to actually uh, go towards i want liver transplant and uh, liver resections but at present i uh, i don't want to join ilbs because uh, i don't want to uh, confine myself just to liver uh, and all that because uh, when you enter sometimes in the field then you feel okay i was thinking uh, this liver is better for me but after 3 years i might you know i need something uh, more Absolutely. or i need something different so this time i'm just keeping my field open uh, let's see after 3 years but i have a liking for hepatobiliary absolutely i think i think uh, uh, abid is uh, will start doing uh, uh, will become a pioneering hepatobiliary transplant surgeon in jnk and initiate one of the finest transplant programs i'm 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 i uh, um, i spoke to a couple of abits friends also who prepared uh, for mch along with them and uh, they were they were in absolute awe of his sincerity and preparation so i am so glad that uh, um abits has done pretty well uh, thank you so much abits for being here with us today and thank you so much for the way uh, uh, your inspiring way you spoke to the, the students also and i wish you uh, on behalf of the entire surgeons team uh, dr gopi uh, who is uh, doing his uh, mcj surgery and me uh, uh, so we both thank you on behalf of the entire surgeons team uh, for supporting us um, for uh, for doing extremely well and uh, i also uh, must thank your parents for producing such a fantastic son uh, who's made them proud and uh, it's my best wishes i'm sure you will do extremely well in your future thank you thank you so much sir i want to thank the entire uh, surgeon team uh, when i excel you and uh, dr gopi sir also 
who have who have been uh, who are in the sort of uh, uh, trying to uh, help the students out building their careers and uh, making uh, more i i hope uh, you will be making more out of this in future and uh, that is your goal and you will uh, inshallah achieve that thank you thank you sir thank you so much abid thank you sir